MLB player props here on price picks. Before I get started, there's a link in the description below, or you can use code TUFF to sign up for price picks. Price picks will match 100% of your first deposit. There is also a Discord link, completely free Discord and Patreon link that are in the description of this video as well. Patreon, I give all my bonus plays for every single sport MLB, NFL, college football, WNBA, and then obviously NBA starting very, very soon. Go ahead and check those links out in the description below. Yesterday, we went two for two on our YouTube plays. We hit on Robbie Ray and Rowanzi Contreras, his overwalks. So two and two yesterday, YouTube plays. Definitely looking to replicate that today. I'm giving two total player props that I do like here on the MLB slate. We got some games starting in the morning. Games going all day, right? We got college football tonight as well as NFL Thursday night football. So a full game or full day of sports to you know bet on, make player props bets on. So we're doing two total player props that I like. Um, again, I'm not a financial advisor. This is not gambling advice. These are simply displays I'm personally looking at making. But yeah, let's not waste any time. Let's get right into it. So the first one's gonna be George Kirby, um, five and a half Ks. I'm smashing the over on this one. Um, George Kirby, he is slowly turning into a very, very elite pitcher. Um, 24 years old, and if you think about it, I mean the Mariners have a pretty solid pitching staff with Robbie Ray, Kirby. Logan Gilbert and Luis Castillo like that's a that's a pitching staff that I don't think teams want to face um come playoff time if the Mariners can stay in that race but George Kirby here facing the Oakland Athletics he's faced them three times this season right has faced them back in July had nine K's faced them in June had six K's and faced them in May and had nine K's so has hit the over all three times he's faced them coming off uh, a game where he had seven K's or eight K's against the Angels uh, six K's against the Atlanta Braves and just overall has hit this numerous times this season. I also like this play for a few reasons. One being that the um, Oakland Athletics over the last, or I guess since this month, um, September 1st, they are striking out second highest rate against right-handers in baseball, 28.7% K rate against right-handers. Um, I think that in combination with how George Kirby's been pitching, this has a chance of maybe getting bumped to six in my opinion. So if you do like it and you see it now, um, I would lock it in. Again, my plays are just to give you analysis and kind of my opinion, help you guys make your own decisions here. But George Kirby over five and a half Ks right now um, against Oakland, who also do have a good amount of bats in that lineup that uh, strike out a ton right here, 20, 20, 40, 40, 25. So, again, a ton of bats in that lineup. That's right. I got a ton against right-handers. I like the over here for George Kirby, 5.5 Ks. Then the other one is going to be one, and I know I've been talking about staying away from hitters, but I think this is a bounce-back game here for Paul Goldschmidt and the entire Cardinals offense to a degree. Um, they, you know, they got almost no hit yesterday against Blake Snell. Blake Snell pitched absolutely amazing. <clears throat> um, but Paul Goldschmidt... His line's at six and a half, right? Uh, you would have never saw about a month ago, you would have never saw Paul Goldschmidt's uh, hitter fantasy score at six and a half. I mean, for a while, it was locked in at eight and a half. So I think there's some value here at six and a half. Um, honestly, kind of surprises at six and a half. In his career against Joe Musgrove, he has 27 plate appearances and 10 hits. He's batting 556 with uh, 833 slugging percentage. He also has drawn nine different, nine walks. Um, so I think, you know, this this line, 27 plate appearances and he's batting 556. That's not a small sample size. Um, I think at six and a half, I think it's some really good value here. Um, I know we've been talking about like staying away from hitters. Um, hitters have been tough. Hitters have been letting us down. It seems like every single day we've been betting on hitters um, on Patreon or wherever it may be. So I know a little risky here with this one, but I think at six, six and a half for Paul Goldschmidt, the value is too good. Um, he hasn't actually been in that bad of a slump. I mean, over his last seven days, he's betting 318. I guess you can say over his last 30, 240, he definitely is, uh, he, you know, Freddie Freeman has definitely, you know, surpassed him in that batting title race here. But I mean, even yesterday, he drew a walk, which isn't horrible. But the game before that, he had a double um, five against Cincinnati. So hopefully, you know, we, he had four strikeouts against Cincinnati, which has just been rough. So we are slowly kind of basing this on career matchup against Musgrove, which again, he's batting 556. And, uh, you know, looking for a bounce back game. But six and a half for Paul Goldschmidt. Uh, I'll take the over on this one. So these are the two total player props I'm playing today. Um, obviously going to give all my Patreon plays. Patreon plays by the time this video goes live. Patreon plays should be live as well. Um, but let me know in the comments below you guys feel about these props. Hit the subscribe button. Drop a like on this video. And as always, have a great day.